Good morning, everybody, at TGIF. A number of incidents working around the valley right now. We have reports of an injury involved accident 215 northbound at Flamingo. Watch out for that. Also, an injury accident at Las Vegas Boulevard and Sahara. And finally, reports of a fender bender at Durango and Flamingo. Let's check on traffic right now. 15 at Flamingo starting to zip right along right there, but no major buildup, so no backups there yet. And then uh, the Spaghetti Bowl, 95 at the 15. Traffic very light right now. Northbound and southbound traffic is moving at a nice little clip. If you are looking for valley traffic information, it's available anytime from Action News on Cox Digital Channel 121 and also available on the web at ktnv.com. There's a check of your morning commute and a check also of your problem solver traffic on the ones. Brought to you by Frank Napoli. We have buyers, so start packing. Call 378-3629. Thirteen, thirteen minutes past five o'clock. Let's check in live right now with Ron Futrell. Is Ron there? What's up? Hey, how you doing? Got got your jeans on? Have you washed those? We're working hard. Have you washed those jeans lately? No. <laughs> we can tell. Not not on this road trip. Not no. on this road trip. <laughs> hey, listen, I want to show did, you. I did change them though. Yeah, I, I want to show you something I real changed. quick on the uh, Doppler, okay. the Midwest Doppler. We've got some showers headed your way just to the west of you by about 60, 70 miles, maybe 100 miles. So Straight that direction from where I'm standing. I'm looking east right now is what you can see behind okay, me. Okay, so behind you is so, west? Yes. That's the way the... No, that, behind me is east. Okay, so you're we'll looking west. We'll show you those clouds you're talking about. Yeah, all right. Yeah, so I'm looking west and I can see them. So you remember that thing you had yesterday? What did they call that? Tornado that, watch? No, 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 the tool you had, the thing you were holding <laughs> in your hand. Umbrella. Oh, oh yeah, umbrella. yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that thing. Yeah, that thing. You might need Kevin's it again later on today. Truck. Hey, how many fans do you think yeah, you so have there so far? Not a whole lot. No, seriously, pro probably a couple of hundred right now uh -huh. that are here at the hotel or at different hotels. It's hard to tell mm -hmm. because there's not one central meeting place for them, but a, probably a couple of hundred, which is, which is not bad. I mean, or we got more than Oregon, I'll tell you that, for tomorrow night. How's that? Or yeah. for tonight. Okay, and and then we've so, got the you've got the late game tonight, so it should be pretty packed, huh? I think it will be. It'll be packed. Um, yeah, you've got the first game is going to be Butler against um, Florida, Florida, right? Which should be a good matchup. All the bad news, sort of, for the Rebels. Yes, all the top seeds advanced yesterday, so I don't know if that's a sign of anything. Right. All the number one and number two seeds advanced, so we'll see yeah. what happens tonight. All right. So when Oregon okay. loses tonight, you'll be able to get Darling Doris a ticket real easy for Sunday's game. <laughs> yes, just yes, go up to can. one of them We're Oregon people. They'll give you money to take the tickets <laughs> off their hands. <laughs> they ass. will. Yeah, please. All right, we'll <laughs> check back in with you later. Get some clean pants. Gotcha. All righty. Uh, there's the shower activity. Ron should be getting wet pretty soon. There, 59 at downtown, 61 in Henderson, 57 out at Spring Valley. Good thing it's an indoor game. 54 at Boulder City, 50 now over the hump in Pahrump. We got a couple smatterings of some showers down south and southeast and east of. Uh, Kingman, but that's about it. Uh, we are looking at low pressure back off south of the Four Corners, wrapping some moisture up this way, but it'll continue to push on off to the east as some of the cloud cover we'll see coming on through. So we'll go 77, partly sunny today. The winds will be light. Good news, 55, partly cloudy tonight. Uh, and then uh, what do we have after that? We'll take a look at the seven-day forecast because the computer locked up here in just a second. Hey, do we give away those tickets right now, Adrian? All right, let's do it. If you're calling number 13 right now, you know the number. Help me out with the number, 257-8341. Is that it? All right, 257-8341. We've got a uh, pair of tickets. Pair of tickets to go see uh, the show tomorrow at Mysterious. Not Mysterious, it's the best Las Vegas show where the Le uh, Las Vegas Review Journal announces the best Las Vegas all categories, okay? Ron is up for best sportscaster. Can you believe that? Yes. Ron has not been a sportscaster in <laughs> well over three, three years, years, and he's nominated for best sportscaster. So, uh, and this makes year, uh, I think, 14 for me that still not nominated. Thank you, people. Uh, but still, uh, we've got a pair of tickets. So call right now. Be the 13th caller. Go. It's going to be a great show. You'll see a lot of celebrities there, and uh, you'll be a part of the show. So it's good. 516, 16 minutes past 5 o'clock. And if Ron happens to win, I bring in Biscuit to accept the award for him. Okay. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. I know how he and Biscuit are just so close.